from my last video, some people uh, had some other questions, um, presented some other ideas. I figured I'd make a follow up. I'll just go over some of those. Um, this one, uh, the first one came from Pyrocat in the Discord. He also has a, a link um, in the Tech Help uh, channel in the Project Quorum Discord to get this all set up. Um, but he asked me about it uh, and suggested making a video for it as well. Um, and these were the two pictures he provided as an example. Uh, so this is the first one. Uh, when you first log in, these will be like the ground textures and the face textures and everything. This was the one that he used to show uh, restoring the uh, more classic ground textures. And he also has the HD uh, faces that I, I showed in the last video. Um, so if you want to get your ground textures like this, uh, again, all the links, all the steps and everything will be in the description. Um, you're going to go to this link. Um, it's another thing on the on the P99 wiki. Um, you're going to download this low res file right here. You're going to unzip it um, and just place it in your uh, directory for wherever you have um, your game. Um, again, back everything up just to be safe. Better to be safe than sorry. Um, something that I hadn't thought of um, that I want to show you guys as well. If tangent, if anyone has issues booting the game up, um, it is probably because you are trying to launch EQ game from the search. Uh, you can't do that. If you want to launch it from search, you need to right click create shortcut or you need to find it in here and launch it from here every time. So there is a possibility that the first time uh, you load up the client, it looks like this. Um, this is the old original stone UI. Um, unfortunately, it is hard stuck at this resolution. You cannot change it. There's nothing that, that you can do about this. Um, if that's the case, um, I will show you how to fix that up uh, while I'm camping out. So you're going to go into your .ini file. You can just search .ini. It's this EQ client one. You want to click on that. You want to find this new UI line. Um, it may say old UI instead. Um, and if it if it if it shows old UI and it has that um, the UI I just showed you, then this will say old UI true. Um, what you want to do is either set old UI to false and then add this new UI line and set this to true, or just put this new UI line to true. Click save. And now, give me a minute, and I'll show you guys what that looks like. So now, uh, when you sign in, it should blow the screen up, and you have everything right here. Um, so that's that's how you fix that. Um, one little tip um, I just want to show real quick. Um, if you are coming from uh, P99 um, and you want to turn off your ability to inspect people, um, the nor like slash toggle inspect will not work. Um, it It's not a valid command on this client. What you're going to do is you're going to type slash inspect. That's it. Space off. And that you should get this message if that works correctly. Chat font size, I believe, is the same. Yeah, it's just slash chat font size and then whatever number you want. Wow, that is very tiny. I think the default is three. Yes, the default is three. The last two things um, I want to show you guys. Uh, the first one is how you copy um, a UI. Um, let me just close out of that because I need this gone. So this is not how you do it for TACP. In TACP, the um, files are named differently. Um, it's whatever this one right here is. Uh, for Project Quorum specifically, it's going to be UI underscore character name underscore PQ dot PROJ. If you want to copy any one character's UI to another character, um, and I just put this on my desktop so that it's always there. Once I've created one, I created this in the beta we had this past weekend. So I have my UI set up and all ready to go. All you will do is you will rename it. You will take the character name and you will just put it right here and then just drag and drop it into um, your directory. It'll ask you if you want to overwrite, say yes, and there you go, you're good to go. Um, and the last thing is blurry text. Uh, it's possible that your text might look a little bit blurry. Um, I don't know what causes it. I don't believe it was ever the case for me when I set uh, TACP up, but for some people it is. So if your text is blurry, uh, you want to find your eqgame.exe file. You're going to right click it, with properties. Uh, then you're going to go to the compatibility tab, 
you're going to click change high DPI settings. Then you'll check this box right here, override high DPI scaling behavior. And you want to make sure this drop down is set to application. And then you're going to click OK. Uh, and after that, you'll click apply. Um, so yeah, I guess that's really all I had right now. Just a couple more little quick tips. Um, some people have had questions about like uh, UI scaling and resolutions and things like that. Um, I don't know a ton about that, um, but I will, I'll, I'll keep looking some stuff up. Uh, and if I happen to find anything, I'll make another one of these for you guys. So thanks.